Welcome to Mathematics with Amps, Grade 8 Lesson, Patterns, and this is an introduction. Please don't forget to give me a huge like and subscribe. Remember, subscription is free. The history of mathematics is a history of people fascinated by numbers. Humans always had an interest in patterns. Discuss in your class examples of patterns you know. So you can discuss amongst yourself what kind of patterns you know. I have a few here for you. Uh, examples in nature, like the golden spiral. For instance, look at the rose bud. You'll notice that the butt of a rose is formed in a spiral. Look at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. If you look at the shell of, of, of any sea creature, then you'll notice that it's also in a spiral form. Look at the cochlea in your ear, your middle ear, then you'll notice the cochlea is also in a spiral form. Or if you look at how the, 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 the beans or the seed on a sunflower is arranged, it is also in a spiral form. Or look at the galaxy, uh, our, our Milky Way is formed in a, is in a form of a spiral. And those are all patterns. Or look at the letters A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. You'll notice there's a pattern. X, Y, Z, X, Y, Z. X, Y, Z, there is a pattern. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and so on. There's a pattern. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, there is a pattern. So there you are. Patterns are all around us. Let's look at numbers and letters. The most common patterns in the number system will be the natural numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The pattern is add 1 to the previous term. So that's a pattern. Even numbers, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, the, the pattern is 2 times each term, or 2n. So you add 2 to every term, so that is your pattern. Or square numbers, 0, 1, 4, 9, 16, 25. Like 0 is 0 squared, 1 is 1 squared, 4 is 2 squared, 9 is 3 squared, 16 is 4 squared, 25 is 5 squared. So there is a pattern. Or 0 equals to 0 times 0, 1 is 1 times 1, 4 is 2 times 2, 9 is 3 times 3. Thus, n to the power 2 is our pattern. Look at cube numbers, for instance. 1, 8, 27, 64. A cube number is 1 times 1 times 1. 8 is 2 times 2 times 2. 27 is 3 times 3 times 3. So therefore, it is each term to the power of 3. So that is your pattern. Or Fibonacci numbers like 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13. It behaves like a spiral. Like 1 plus 1 is 2, 2 plus 1 is 3, 3 plus 2 is 5, 5 plus 3 is 8, 8 plus 5 is 13, and that is how the pattern is formed. Pascal's triangle, 1 is 1 is 2 to the power 0, 1 plus 1 is 2, which is 2 to the power 1, 1 plus 2 plus 1 is 4, which is 2 to the power 2, 1 plus 3 plus 3 plus 1 is 8, which is 2 to the power 3, 1 plus 4 plus 6 plus 4 plus 1 is 16, 2 to the power 4. So can you see the pattern? 2 to the power 0, 2 to the power 1, 2 to the power 2, 2 to the power 3, 2 to the power 4, so therefore 2 to the power n. If you look at the diagram, you can see very clearly how the pattern is formed. Patterns in physical or diagram form. If we look at diagrams or geometric shapes, patterns can be represented in physical diagrams. Like if the, the Sierpinski triangle, for instance, you will notice that repetition of triangles within triangles. So the pattern cut out triangles in the center for each of the remaining triangles. Second figure perform the same act. Third figure iterate indefinitely. So you can see what happens here, how the pattern has been iterated. So there's a pattern. If you look at the matchsticks. If you look at the matchsticks and you look at the first diagram, we'll have four, five, six, six, uh, three, four, five, six sticks. Then the next one will be six plus five sticks, which is 11. Then the third one is 6 plus 5 plus 5, which gives you 16 sticks. Then the next one the th will be 6 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5, 21 sticks. So you can see there is a pattern. 6 plus 5 is 11, plus 5 is 16, plus 5 is 21. So there is definitely a pattern. 
the third example, which we call tiling. You notice figure one got one tile, figure two got four tiles, figure three got three, six, nine tiles, and figure four got 16 tiles, figure five got 25 tiles. So this is also then square number. So therefore, enter the power of two. Right, I hope you've enjoyed this little introduction to patterns in nature, patterns in numbers, and patterns in shapes. So this is Ahmed Suleiman from Maths with, with Mathematics with M's. Please give me a huge like and don't forget to subscribe. Remember, subscription is free.